What's really cool about it though, is you will go through the first time user experience every time you create a tenant, which will help you create all of your automations. I'll show you how that works. It's actually really, really cool. I love this. And if you're a long time PQ Connect customer, you've maybe missed some of the new onboarding capabilities, but I'm gonna go back to creating a tenant really fast. Uh, we're gonna make another tenant. We'll go example tenant 100. I've probably made a million of these already. I'll click create. And this is my new tenant. It's blank. There's nothing in it. And what's really cool about creating a tenant now is you have the ability to, to uh, benefit from all the auto setup. Mm -hmm. Again, if you're a long-term customer, you've, you've never seen this. I'm going to click, uh, yeah, we'll click continue here. I can choose which applications I care about. Uh, now these are building out your groups, right? It's going to build out your groups and your automations. So it's going to make it really easy to get a new tenant up, up and running. Uh, we'll skip that for now. It's going to create all of our devices for us. And it's going to keep doing that. It's making all the automations for all of those groups and all those applications. And then I can switch over to automations and pre-built all wow. those automations. So creating a new tenant is way easier than it used to be when you create a yeah. new account. We're going to help you get it configured exactly how you want it to be configured. Yeah. And we're still looking at other things, right? As far as like the multi-tenancy goes and like carrying over like packages, mm -hmm. things like that. So there'll, there'll definitely be more coming on that stuff, but this is like a terrific start. Yeah, even where it's at today, I mean, it's super useful, especially if you're trying to, to break apart accounts for some reason. Either, you know, again, very common for MSPs, but also very common for internal IT when they're working on different types of devices or different geos. Uh, this is a great feature. You should use it now.